Chuck Wagon MTG is sponsored by BC Comics and Games. Welcome everyone and thank you for joining us for another great deck tech on Chuckwagon MTG. November 11th is a federal holiday in the United States named Veterans Day. It reminds us to remember those who serve and who have served in our military forces. So, in honor of our fighting men and women, I offer you the tribute popper deck, Red, White, and Blue Soldiers. Red, White, and Blue Soldiers is a fun budget popper deck that you can pick up for about $27 in paper and less than three ticks online. While this deck is meant to be a tribute to our armed forces past and present, it does have some soldier-based synergies that make it extremely fun to play. So let's sally forth into the deck. As you can probably guess, this deck plays only soldier creatures, and we play a lot of them, 27 in all. Our one-drop soldiers are Thraben Inspectors, a strong 1-2 creature for 1 white that investigates upon entry and can help you with card draw. Our 2-drop soldiers begin with Fencing Ace, a 1-1 one, one for 1 and a white with Double Strike. Ninth Bridge Patrol is a 1-1 one, one creature for 1 and a white that gets a 1-1 one, one counter for every creature that leaves the battlefield. Both of these creatures can provide early game threats that have to be dealt with. Ninth Bridge Patrol can easily get out of hand if ignored, and Fencing Ace can benefit from our 3-drop creature, Wojak Bodyguard. It's a 3-3 human soldier for 2 and a red that has Mentor. When this creature attacks with a creature of less power, you can put a 1-1 one, one counter on that other attacking creature. With so many 1-drops, this Mentor trigger can distribute a lot of power quickly. In the 4-drop spot, we have Daru Stinger a 1-1 one, one creature for 1 white and 3 that has Amplify. Amplify is a keyword ability on creatures that allows the player to reveal creature cards in his or her hand that share a creature type with that creature. The creature enters the battlefield with a number of 1-1 one, one counters for each such card revealed. Also, you can tap Daru and deal damage equal to the number of 1-1 one, one counters on it to a target attacking or blocking creature. With so many creatures in your deck, it's not unreasonable to think that this can be as large as 4-4 when it hits the battlefield. Thraben Sentry is a 2-2 human soldier for 3 and a white that has Vigilance. When another creature you control dies, you can transform it into Thraben Militia, a 5-4 human soldier with Trample. Elgod Shieldmate is a 2-3 human soldier for 3 and a blue with Soul Bond. When this creature enters the battlefield, you can pair it with another creature giving them both Hexproof. Finally, our 5-drop is Conclave Phalanx, a 2-4 human soldier for 4 and a white with Convoke. When it enters the battlefield, you gain a life for each creature you control. Acknowledging that this deck moves slower than other tiered decks, you can gain back some ground by getting this one out whenever you can. Our supporting spells include Piety Charm, an instant for one white that lets you choose between destroying a target or attached to a creature, helpful with Bogles, giving a target soldier plus two plus two until end of turn, or giving all of your creatures vigilance until end of turn. This is one card that acts as a grab bag of abilities that can act defensively or offensively. 
Also in that vein is Unified Strike, an instant for one white that exiles a target attacking creature if its power is less than or equal to the number of soldiers on the battlefield. Taking advantage of your many soldier creatures, this will be an unexpected response to an attack. For card draw, we have Ponder, a sorcery for one blue that lets you look at the top three cards of your library and put them back in any order, or just shuffle your library and draw a card. We have Lightning Bolt because sometimes you need Lightning Bolt. For one red, it does three damage to any target. This is the best card in Magic, or at least that's what I hear. Our lands include two Boros Guild Gates, two Is It Guild Gates, two Tranquil Coves, three Sandstone Bridges, three Islands, five Mountains, and five Plains, 22 lands in total. The sideboard has two additional Piety Charms and two additional Unified Strikes. It has three Ephemeral Shields, an instant for one and a white with Convoke that can give a target creature indestructible until end of turn. Since you're running smaller creatures, you'll want to protect them as much as possible if you come up against a heavy removal deck. Same goes for the two Rootborn Defenses, an instant for two and a white that gives all of your creatures indestructible until end of turn. It also has Populate, an ability that does not really apply to this deck. We have four Faithless Lootings, if you need more card draw, two Nihil Spell Bombs, if you're playing against a Delver deck or any graveyard deck. Once again, play around with the sideboard to fit it against your meta. Don't be afraid to throw out suggestions, and I would personally like to thank all of those who serve or who have served our country through the armed forces. Your sacrifice will always be remembered. Well, thank you for watching. We here at Chuck Wagon MTG hope you enjoyed this deck tech. If you did, please hit the like, subscribe, and the bell notification to see what's new. And be sure to share this with your friends, your family, your loved ones, your pets. Everyone could use a little more magic in their lives. Thanks again, and be sure to find us on Facebook and Twitter. Let us know what you think. Now hang on tight from a word from the best gaming store in Michigan. Chuck Wagon MTG is sponsored by BC Comics and Games, now at one mega location to fill all of your gaming and comic needs. They have Magic the Gathering events every night of the week, as well as Warhammer, Pathfinder, Dungeons and Dragons Adventures League, Final Fantasy TCG, Pokemon, and Star Wars X-Wing events all throughout the week. They also have close to 100,000 comics on site. This is why I have personally made BC Comics and Games my home gaming store.